We can do now in two days what used to take us two to three weeks. The reason for that is the technology that we use. We use a non-contact optical scanner to acquire the limb shape. It's very similar to what you see in the grocery store. When you pass through the aisle, they scan barcodes. It's the same type of uh, non-threatening device. The scanner is housed in a black box. In that black box, there's a computer and a camera. Actually, two cameras, two eyes, just like you and I. Both cameras are seeing what your eyes see. But they're storing it digitally on the computer. It doesn't hurt. You don't feel anything. We're just painting with light. Education is a very important part of what we do. We spend um, uh, less evaluation and clinical time now uh, using the, the laser scanning technology. What that allows us to do is to free up uh, about 75% of the time that we would spend typically on a, on a conventional evaluation to spend with the patient, uh, learning about their family, learning about their environment, uh, uh, asking them critical questions that we may have otherwise missed, uh, critical information about their, uh, their livelihood, their family life, their wants, what, what do they expect. And we help them define their expectations. It's about a 40 minute window between the end of the scan and the beginning of the test fitting. We use this time between the scan and the, the test fitting to get to know the patient. We're working with the patient and the patient's family. Developing a plan for their limb, developing a plan for their rehab. That then is just the beginning. It's the beginning of learning how to operate within a new system. It's not just a prosthesis that we're providing. Those are all equally important pieces in the puzzle. People that's been amputees for years have dealt with the same mentality for years, uh, where they think that that's the way it's supposed to be, uh, but it doesn't have to be. Uh, I tell them, you know, come look at what we do, uh, see the way we we start out with you. It's totally different than anything that most of them have has experienced before. Uh, we bring them in, we show them the uh, the different products. Uh, we show them our, our technology. Uh, we kind of sit down with them, explain everything as we go. Uh, but while we're explaining things, we usually we have already taken our scanner and did a scan. Uh, we've modified that socket. We've sent it back to the guys in the, in the back. Uh, our carver machine has received the information. It's carved out a model of that person. While we're still sitting there talking, uh, explaining things, uh, answering questions. Uh, Usually in about an hour and a half, we've got that patient in the gate room and, and we're walking them on that product and uh, letting them see the comfort level. Uh, we spend a lot of time in our sockets. Uh, we want to make sure they're comfortable, they're functional, and they're going to do the job they need to. So once that's done, then the rest of it is, uh, it comes, comes easier uh, because if they can walk on it comfortably, they can feel the, the full use of it. And then we send it back for fabrication and uh, our, our techs are trained and uh, they know that this person is going to be wearing this for you know, several years. Uh, so they, they spend a lot of time, take a lot of care of that. And uh, once we get it back in there in a couple of hours and get it on them, uh, you see the look on their face that they hadn't, they hadn't ever experienced before because they've just got that prosthesis uh, done that day and it's most comfortable, most functional prosthesis they've ever had. And so that means a lot to them.